Elvira, the Mistress of the Dark, model kit by Mobius, coming up next on What's in the Box. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Hello once again to another chilling episode of Monster Hobbies What's in the Box as we start to look at our monster model kits. And today we're going to look at the Elvira, Mistress of the Dark model kit by Mobius. And this has got a pretty cool box on the back. It actually shows a painted example of the model in question. And you can see that it's the nice Mistress of the Dark sitting on her couch with her dog. Anyway, let's go down to the bench and open this thing up. Now let's look at the horror hostess who's got the mostess, Elvira, Mistress of the Dark. Now this is a really cool kit. It is a 1 8 scale plastic assembly kit for skill level 3, which means that ages 18, uh, 15 and up, 18, <laughs> 15 and up, will be able to do this kit pretty well. So let's open up the box and see what's in it. So first off, we have our instruction sheet. And of course it's got a write-up on Elvira. Who started her career in 1981. Which is interesting. Okay, so here she is. You can see how many pieces are involved with this. It is 1 8 scale, so it'll fit right in with all you Aurora monster model builders. And Elvira, it's got her dog, Gronk, right here. And of course, there's the couch. Now there's a lot of cool little features like the candelabra, and the skeleton arm and the head, the mouse, and a rug monster. And if you turn it over, it also gives you the colors to paint. And it is very, very cool. All right, let's see what it looks like in plastic. Oh, we've got a nice bag here with a big brass rod in it, which must be for the candle. Candelabra. And I will just cut the plastic on this. Now the Elvira model kit is one of these ones that Mobius has, and then they stop making it, and then they start making it again. So always be on the constant watch for it. So here it looks like I've got an Elvira leg piece molded in skin color. Oh yes, there's the other one. Trying to run away on me, are you? <laughs> and these are the legs for the couch, or the sofa. And this looks like some cloth and things. I'm not quite sure what that is. That's why we have the instructions or the destructions if you've built the model and you're trying to take it apart piece by piece. You can read the destructions backwards. <laughs> okay, anyway. Now, there is the skull, and as you can see, it still has an eyeball in it, which is very spooky. Okay, the, oh, there's Gronk right there with his punk rock, rebellious dog attitude. And I believe this will be for the candelabra. And spiderwebs and rats with no heads. That's, that's an interesting way to mold that. And there's the eyes for the rug monster. And here we have the other side. There. There's Gronk, the other half. The back of the skull. <laughs> half of Gronk. Does this not remind you of... Return of the Living Dead, where they had the half dogs that came back to life in the science lab. There's the skeleton hand. I'm not sure what that piece is. Some candles, melted wax, cool stuff. Maybe I won't open this bag, but there is the rug in the carpet. There's even holes in the carpet. And I believe this is part of the couch. 
yeah, the backrest for the coach. Ooh, and here's the other part of the coach. Oh, that would be the seat cushion. Ha, yes. There's the other part of the coach, and look at that cool detail. This would be something to paint. I probably want to do this with an airbrush, which I don't have, so I will be brush painting that big surface, believe it or not. And now, to reveal the hostess with the mostess, who's eating French toastess, we have Elvira in the bag. And this is going to look really weird, but... <laughs> okay. There's her face. And there's holes in the top of her head for that hairdo of hers. And that would be the back of her head. And then some of her arms and parts. Parts unknown. <laughs> okay. And here is some more of her body. Oh, her little Elvira dagger there. And now this is where the 18A rating comes in. No, I'm just kidding, but oh ho! There's one of her major features. Uh, two of them, actually. And then here we have her hair. And there should be the three pegs there, or two pegs. And her hands. And the other leg. And the infamous high heels, which must be painted black. Uh, now, let's see. Oh, excuse my hands. Okay. I just want to see, there's her head. And then that would be her hair going over the top. <laughs> Crazy. Okay, so that brings us to the conclusion of our monster, What's in the Box, with our Elvira, Mistress of the Dark. And always remember to watch the Elvira, Mistress of the Dark movie, because it is groovy. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Monster Hobbies, What's in the Box, when we got to look at Elvira. And can you remember the name of Elvira's dog? Yes, if you can, please write it in the comments below. And we hope to check you out next time. But in the meantime, check out these other monster videos here, here, and here. And don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel right down here so I can continue opening up monster model kits as well as other model kits. And until next time, pleasant dreams. Ah, ah, ah.